Greetings everyone and Happy New Year. Now today is going to be our last video review of 2022. Uh, we are going to be doing our side-by-side uh, -side comparison showing you what Monster Bass and Sixth Sense sent us for December of 2022. Now the thing I like most about both these subscriptions is it doesn't matter if you're new to fishing or if you've been doing it for your entire life, you still are going to get quality gear delivered to your house every month. Now the price range is right around the same. It all depends on, you're looking at between $30 and $40 depending on how long you subscribe for and what you're going to pay for with your plan because that's going to decide by the longer you subscribe, the, low, the smaller your price goes down, a couple dollars each time. It's really cool. So we're going to go in, we're going to grab our boxes, we're going to show you guys what they sent us, and we're going to let you decide which one you thought for December 22 was the best. Stick with us, we'll tell you all about it. This video is intended for all ages. So as I turn it around, this is what I'm going to show you. First off, we've got both boxes. This is the Monster Bass uh, Platinum and the Sixth Sense Super Sack. I'm going to set the Monster Bass over there. We're going to crack open the Sixth Sense. First off, you get the sack. You get another one of these crushed velvet style uh, Christmas colored bags. I love them. They come in really handy. Throw your soft plastics in them and you can organize your soft plastics by group. You can write on them. It's, you know, they come with your, your baits. So that's one thing I really enjoy doing. I'll throw my wacky, my wacky worms in here, uh, write it on there. Just so when I'm reaching back, trying to dig it out of my milk crate, I fish out of a kayak, that it allows me to know where my stuff is. Keeps it a little more organized. You know, you're on a kayak, it's a little harder. So first off, we're going to start off with the plastics. Uh, first thing we got was a pack of Divine Swim Baits, 3.8 ounce, 3.8 uh, inch in Golden Shiner. Great color. Great color. I'm in Georgia. Uh, Shiner color works really, really well, and I love their swim baits. Just awesome. Now, let's see. We've got a... Oh, that's not a jig head. It's an underspin. We got ourselves a divine, a half-ounce divine underspin with a willow blade and what looks like a shad pattern. It's chartreuse from the belly. Um, shad truce. So, probably the combination of the two. Sexy shad, chartreuse, sexy truce, or shad truce. Very nice. These are awesome. These with this combination will catch fish. I really enjoy them. Um, next, they gave us a four pack or three pack of quarter ounce four aught. That's where the four four came from. Um, jig heads. Now these I like a little better because these have at least the shiner color on the bottom. Very nice. And this is in Sungill. Not bad. I like that color. Love these baits. Love these baits. Um, next. Let's get in here. Uh, we're gonna grab another one. Let's see what we got. Oh, nice. Swank 77X. Now this is like a wake bait, in a way. Um, it's a crankbait, but it doesn't go deep. Uh, what do they list it as? Let me see. Where'd it go? Three quarters of an ounce, so a big heavy. Uh, two to five feet, so just below the surface. Very nice. I love that color too. Got that green, seems to be our theme. Uh, thread fin shad, great bait, guys, great bait. Big hook, big sharp hooks, everything about it, nice. Put that over there, reach in here and grab another one. Nice, we got ourselves a Crush Mini 25MD. Let's see if I can figure out what color it is, because it was all flipped over. Another one, got that green and gold. Got that lavender, purple, very nice. Baby shad, very nice bait. Quarter ounce. I like that a lot. I like the fact that it's a diving crankbait, but it's a smaller profile. That's going to help you. You know. Next. Ooh, nice. Whoa, look at that color. Nice. That is a Quake 70. That's a 70 millimeter, 5 8 ounce lipless crankbait. Rip those things out of those grass. Man, that's a nice bait. Uh, that one's in Mud Gill. Man, that's really nice. That's the one thing I really, really like about Sixth Sense is the colors are incredible. I mean, look at that blue. Look at the blue up around the eyes up there. Man, that's nice. Got that, you know, bluegill um, sunfish color going on. 
Um, next, nice. A Crush 50 Silent. Now that's important. Um, you don't always want all that extra noise. Very nice bait. You got that yellow on the top, pearl on the sides, blue up on the head. Man, that's a nice looking bait. This one's in Bone Reactor. Very nice. I like that. I love their square bill crankbaits. Um, I love their flat 77s and or flat 75s, and their crankbaits are just awesome. That's what got them started. When I first started buying fish at the six cents, it was crankbaits. And last but not least, we've got ourselves an Axis Metal 2.0, uh, two to five foot diver, half ounce. Very nice. Got that metal lip. Man, these things are nice. I like that. That one's in Sensory Shad. I like that a lot, guys. Boom. Look at those holographic scales. That's cool. That's what I'm talking about. The stuff they do when it comes to their colors are incredible. Um, Casey over there at Sixth Sense does some great stuff. And the guy's just a rock star. So, good job, Casey. As always. Put that all back in there. And let's grab Monster Bass. And let's see what they sent us. All right. So here we go, monster bass. Ooh, nice, we got a buff. Very nice. We got a buff. We got a flyer saying protect your gear. Real cleaning process. Oh, nice, so that, they've done really well this year. They've broken down and given us some crazy stuff that's gonna be like what, like the stuff that they give, the details is where they break down and where they just give you some just awesome stuff. Um, I've really enjoyed their pa their little pamphlets they've been doing this year. They've really done a good job with them. Okay, and then it looks like they're going to break it down, and we're doing some takeovers. Three killer box coming your way. January is going to be a Lunker Hunt limited edition takeover with a Swim Vanitas and Strike King limited edition box and a Z-Man box. Very cool. It says the Strike King box will have a Thunder Cricket and the Z-Man will have a Jackhammer. Very cool stuff, guys. Gives you a little hope for what they're going to come up with for this year. Move that over here. Whoops, I bumped my camera. Sorry. First off, let's talk about it. Uh, bait Labs. Very nice. Little short, stinny uh, jerk bait. Is it a sinker or a floater? Trying to see. And... Plasma Perch. I do like that color. Look at that. That is cool. Got those weights. Got a good rattle. That's a nice looking bait. Bait Labs makes some great stuff. Uh, next, we got ourselves a Bruiser Baits, the Defender. Square build crankbait, and I'm assuming that's like a sexy shad. Sexy shad. Boom, boom. Love that. Look at that thing. That is cool. Good looking bait. Next. Vicious Fishings Lipless. That's a nice looking lipless. Big heavy rattle. Man, that's nice. The Trapper. Two and a half ounce, two and a half inch length, half ounce lipless crankbait in the crawfish pattern. Uh, they call it Delta Craw. That's nice, guys. That's going to be huge. Hell, this will probably do really well right now. Uh, crawfish patterns have been doing really well here in Georgia this month. Uh, here in December, even with all the cold. Um, next, we got ourselves another bait. 13 Fishing Popping McPop Face. 75. That's a good looking popper. Look at that thing. Cool color. That blue and silver is always popular and always does really well. Chrome Blueback. I like that. 13 Fishing. Man, these guys have done, been doing some great stuff. I've just picked up one of their spent one of their new bait casters, a radioactive pickle. Very cool stuff. Thirteen fishing, really jumping back out there and really making a dent in the new market with some new great baits. Their crank baits, their square bill crank baits, are still one of my favorites. Um, next, we got ourselves some Lunker Hunt pre-rigged Ned rigs. Got a couple of extra plastics for you. Quarter ounce, three inch, in like green pumpkin, I'm assuming. Watermelon red. Okay. I like that. These are really cool. I like picking these up just because if you don't have everything set up to go fishing, 
and you want to throw a Ned rig, it's cool to just be able to have this without having to dig out your entire terminal tackle. You know, just comes in handy for me. I like that. Next, we got ourselves here. Before I forget about this, I'm going to show you what else they sent us. They sent us some sticker, another sticker. That's a pretty cool sticker. It's like a monster robot. I like that. It's like a robot fish. Um, next is a free t-shirt on a $25 order of MBF 25. Oh, nice. That's not bad. I like that. Uh, we got ourselves a pack of hooks, spear point 3.0, three aught, uh, three pack. Very nice. I love these little hooks. These little hooks got that really odd design to them, but man, they work. They work really good, and you know they just they're they're convenient and they come in really really handy. Um, next, we got ourselves a pack of big bite baits, some type of little minnow. Can't tell. Really. Okay, so yeah. Drop shot minnow, but it's got a, I like that. It's got a real, like, segmented tail. Can you see that? I like that. Just gives you a little more action, especially if you're doing something like a drop shot, you know? Because your drop shot, you're trying not to move it too much. You're kind of letting the water do the action, and then you're just barely twitching your line. So that comes in really handy. Um, that one's in Smoke Discuit Violet Lamb. Okay. Soft uh, 3.75 jointed jerk minnow. 10 pack. Very cool. I like that. And last but not least, the goat. Now these, I give them that. This is probably one of my favorite Z-Man bait. Um, I really like this uh, just because it's a great trailer. Let's see if I can break one of these loose. And it's just got a great action without being too much. Um, this one's a goat. This one's a four pack, 3.75. Very nicely done. Very excited. Very nice. Throw that back in there. And this is in black and blue. I like that. That's a good bait. I just bought some of these from Tackle Warehouse um, before Christmas. So. Very cool. And that's it. That's the Monster Bass box. Now, I will not, I will say that this is a pretty good box. They did a real good job uh, of closing out the year. Is it the best box they've done all year? No, but Christmas is always a weird time when it comes to baits. Uh, we've got to throw all this stuff back in, but not a bad selection. Covered our bases, um, got ourselves a topwater, we got ourselves a square bill, a lipless, and a jerk bait. Man, you should be able to take this box and go out there and catch something. And you got your Ned rigs. This covers everything. Then you got your hooks and your plastic. Only way this would have been better, better is if there was a bladed jig in here. Some type of bladed jig, a Thunder Cricket, uh, one of the cheap Z-Man um, chatter baits, something like that would have been just rounded it off. It would have been untouchable. Just that little bit. I mean, yeah, you're talking about a 4 or $5 bait, but, you know, very nice. All right, so I turned the camera around. Wanted to talk, close this out. Wanted to say first, first you got to comment. You got to comment down below. Tell me which one you think is better, Monster Bass, Six Cents, uh, this month. Don't don't go, go being classic and saying all you know for what Monster Bass did all this year, or Six Cents all this year. They both done really really well. I've been very happy with both, but I want to know this box. Which one did you like? Uh, we will be getting them in 2023. We'll be getting both subscriptions again. Um, we did cancel out um, Champions Club from Major League Fishing canceled, so we won't be getting that. So if you know of another fishing subscription that you think would be great and you'd like to see us test out and review, please do. I think both these boxes this month are the kind of boxes you could just grab the box, take it on the water, and go catch some fish. Um, might be willing to try it. We'll have to see. But I wanted to say thank you to each and every one of you for being part of our community, for being part of our giveaway that we did all in, back for 12 days of Christmas. Thank you guys so much. Make sure you go check those videos out because that's the only way you're going to know whether or not you won. Um, I appreciate it. I think you guys are awesome, and I thank you for your support. Hope you had a Merry Christmas, and I hope you have a wonderful New Year, and I hope 2023 is the best year yet. God bless each and every one of you. I'll put links down below to both these boxes if you want to try them out. And guys. 
We'll see you next week. God bless. We'll talk to you soon.